tension is palpable and you can understand why. Two high-level sides about to face each other and it's anyone's guess how this is going to end up. It is Chelsea, they face Arsenal live right here on EA TV. A meeting that evokes memories of the 2019 Europa League final when Chelsea ran out 4-1 winners against Arsenal in faraway Baku. Today, Stamford Bridge is the venue. Derek Ray in the commentary position and Stuart Robson is alongside me. Stuart, what are you looking forward to seeing? Well, Derek, these are two big London clubs that expect to win trophies and we should get a good game here. There's some really top-class players on view today. And here's how it looks for Chelsea. Well, it's a 4-5-1, but with three of the midfield players giving close support to the centre forward, and the other two sitting deeper. Also watch out for the fullbacks getting forward at every opportunity. They do like to get crosses into the box. And this is the Arsenal starting 11. Aaron Ramsdale is the goalkeeper. Kai Havertz starts alongside Martin Odegaard in central midfield. And the main striker here is... Can he get them the lead? Crucial piece of defending. <laughs> now a short corner here. Preferring to go infield. He'll be breathing a sigh of relief. Ball one. Well, you always feel a bit sorry for teams having to face this Arsenal defence because they have been formidable, Stuart. Well, their defensive game plan is second to none this season and that comes down to the coach and he's... Oh, hang on, Stuart, it's a chance! Well, good defending to stop a decent-looking attack. Gabriel... It's with Erdogan. Ben White. Well, that's how to dispossess your opponent. Intelligent threaded pass here. And Arsenal unable to retain possession. Thiago Silva. This is Thiago Silva. Caicedo. Conor Gallagher. Thiago Silva. Really good attacking play. Not getting anxious when they have the ball. His determination there for all to see. Must take the lead here. Fernandez. Magnificent challenge to win it back. Well, that's really strong play to keep hold of the ball. Now making considerable progress with the ball. Plenty of players waiting in the middle. Conor Gallagher. Di Sassi. Gallagher. Sterling. Now Chelsea in a position of menace. Well, nothing comes of it. It looked promising. Ben White. And Ketia has it.
And there goes the half-time whistle. Arsenal find themselves on level terms at the break. Your analysis. Well, underway once more. And it's going to be fascinating to see what developments occur in the second half. Arsenal recovering possession well. Bukayo Saka. Arsenal move it forward with purpose and control. Saka. Well, good run and good ball control. A cut back. And unable to pick out a teammate. And that'll be a throw. And time for the change now. To be replaced by number 19, Leandro Trossard. Being pressed and pressed high. Gusto. Sterling. Well, that's good defending. Well organised at the back. Kossav. Well, moving the ball forward, they might be in business. And Kai Havertz. He has time to play it over. It's gone in! And well, he might celebrate on the back of that. Well, they love him, and he loves them. It's great scenes here. Well, here it is again, and credit to the goal scorer, but you have to ask questions of the keeper. He's got to have that near post covered for me. No wonder he's frustrated with himself. So Chelsea get things going again. How will they reply to that setback? Gallagher. Di Sassi. Malo Gusto. Axel Di Sassi. This is Thiago Silva. Connor Gallagher. Axel Di Sassi. And Chelsea moving the ball forward. What can they do from here? Enzo Fernandez. It's looking promising. Not forcing the issue. Great composure. But then the one that goes astray. Bukayo Saka. Martin Odegaard. Havertz! And tidy defensive play. Well, it's going to be a great finish here. These Chelsea fans are ramping up the noise now. They're surely going to get another chance before the end. The clock is not on Chelsea's side, but it's not over for them. to get tighter he'll be breathing a sigh of relief ball one can they hit on the break can they make it count can he finish them all he's done it what a climax to this game
Well, here it is again, and it's all about the pace in transition. They're so quick to get out from the back, and when he gets onto it, he decides to go for power. It's a really emphatic finish, which gives the keeper no chance. So the ball rolling again at 2-0. Caicedo. Enzo Fernandez. Mikhailo Mudrik. Nicely timed tackle. Two minutes of stoppage time coming up. And the referee blows his whistle. Now we can say it officially. Arsenal have won this game. Three points for them. What did you make of it all? Well, we spoke about their great defensive record, but today it was all about their front players. I thought they were excellent. Their ability to turn with the ball around the edge of the box was a real feature of their play. They were certainly good value for that win.